Good morning, Greater Latrobe. From the WCAT TV studio, I'm Corbin Maycar alongside Gianna Ferry, and these are your morning announcements. Purchase your boys' basketball section champs t-shirts in the student store for a discounted price of just $5. There is a limited supply, so get yours today. All students in grades 9 through 11 are asked to check your email for, for your scheduling appointments for the 2019-2020 school year. Please be sure to check scheduling appointments daily. Times and dates are subject to change. Students are reminded to check the 11-12 student waiting area for job opportunities. Any senior who is planning on attending St. Vincent this fall, please stop by the 11-12 office as soon as possible for scholarship information. The deadline to apply is March 15. There will be a link leader meeting on, Monday, on Wednesday, March 6 during Lunch and Learn 2 in C106. Attention student athletes and weight room enthusiasts. The backyard brawl is back with the goal of meeting this year, this year the biggest yet. Derry, Hemfield, Norwin, Mount Pleasant, Penn Trafford, and Ligonier have all been invited to battle for the trophy this year. There will be the traditional partner workout in the weight room and several new additional optional contests in the main gym. Participants will spend the whole day celebrating and challenging their fitness with their peers. See Ms. Zingas or Mr. Jerry for more information. Registration is $15 and is due by Friday, March 8th. The Tape the Teacher FBLA fundraiser has been postponed until the pep rally is rescheduled. If you have donated money, it has been applied to the teacher of your choice and will remain there when the competition resumes. Now here's Devin Watson with a three-day forecast. Good morning, Wildcats. It's time for your local weather report. Today, expect mostly sunny skies with some clouds moving in and out throughout the day along with a high of 37 and a low of 28. Tomorrow, the sunshine will disappear and will bring mostly cloudy skies all day, along with a high of 45 and a low of 34. And on, sun on Saturday, we'll have mostly cloudy skies with a chance for some light afternoon rain, along with a high of 48 and a low of 24. That's all for your weather report. Thanks, and back to you. Thanks, Devin. Students are reminded to check the guidance webpage for scholarships. A variety of scholarships are added daily. Today is the absolute last day to order yearbook. There is no guarantee that extra books will be available at the end of the year. There will be a mandatory baseball meeting for anyone trying out for the team this year on Friday at 3 in C106. This week, you can order Pi Day t-shirts available in Sand or Periwinkle for $6. Order forms can be found in any math teacher's room. All orders and payments are due this Friday, March 1st, at the end of the day. Latrobe Parks and Recreation is searching for lifeguards for the 2019 season at Rogers McFeely Memorial Pool. If you are interested, please see Mr. Schmeling in the Junior High, Classroom A201. If you are currently being certified or already certified, feel free to pick up an application. Now here is Connor Mondock with the Sports Report. Thanks, Corbin. The Latrobe varsity hockey team has been working very hard this season to make the playoffs and has appreciated all the fans' support. Their first playoff game is a home game on Monday, March 4th at Nevin Arena in Greensburg. Game time is 7.15 p.m. and the admission fee is $5. Congratulations to the Letterman's Club Athlete of the Week, sophomore Ryan Sickenberger. Ryan had a tremendous second half of the basketball season. He set personal bests in scoring three times in the last two weeks of the season. For the second half of the season, he averaged 14.3 points and 2.7 steals per game. Ryan's career-high 19-point performance helped the Wildcats defeat Hempfield for an undefeated second record of 10-0. Congratulations, Ryan. That's all for sports. Back to you. Thanks, Connor. To those of you who have visited the student store and made a purchase this year, thank you. Within the next several weeks, we will suppress the total number of customers we had all of last school year. To celebrate, we'd like to give away a $50 store gift card to the specific customer who suppresses last year's total. Keep stopping in and maybe it'll be you. The winner will be announced right here on WCAT-TV. We will be back after this message. A story of Don Quixote told by the author Miguel de Cervantes as he waits in a prison cell with other prisoners. He tells the prisoners a tale of Alonso Quijana, an older man who reads so many books about knights that he becomes crazy and thinks that he is a knight errant named Don Quixote. Don Quixote and his squire Sancho set on a quest to find adventures. On the way, they find themselves in a castle and meet a beautiful lady named Dulcinea, 
when in reality the castle is an inn and the beautiful lady is a kitchen maid named Aldonza. Will the knight reach the impossible dream or will his worried family stop him? Come see Man of La Mancha! Man of La Mancha will be performed this Friday and Saturday at 7.30 p.m. and this Sunday at 1.30 p.m. in the Senior High Auditorium. Tickets are $15 for adults and $10 for students. You may purchase them at the door on the night of the show. We go now to Preston Yingling with What's Cooking Late Throw. What's cooking, Latrobe? It's Thursday, February 28th, and the main line is cooking up a chicken parmesan bowl alongside a warm garlic knot and broccoli top. Over in the cultural corner, we got General Tso's popcorn chicken with fluffy brown rice and more broccoli top. Finally, the soup of the day is Fiesta Taco. That's what's cooking. Thanks and back to you guys. Thanks, Preston. In Ms. Rebel's AP research class, senior Carly Augustine is conducting a research study on the usage of Flex Time Manager after further teacher encouragement. At this time, you are asked to please visit FlexTime Manager, review the activities, and sign up for Ms. Rebel's mock activity in order to assure that you visited the website for the day. This activity is only a model requiring zero commitment to anything you have to report to that day. However, by signing up for this activity daily, you are entering yourself in a drawing to win a $10 gift card to the student store. Five, to, five of these gift cards are available to win. Please only sign up for this activity once per day. Thank you for your cooperation in this research study to improve the use of Flex Time Manager in order to make it a successful implementation. Prom is just around the corner. Tickets go on sale April 1st through the 5th. All students attending prom need to complete a permission form. Please pick up your form from the 1112 office, complete it, and submit it back to the 1112 office by March 25th. Freshmen cannot attend prom, and sophomores can only attend if they are asked by a junior or senior. You need a signed permission form in order to purchase your ticket, so don't wait until the last minute to complete your forms, especially if you're bringing a guest from another school. Reporting for WCAT-TV, this has been Gianna Ferry and Corbin Makar. Thanks for watching and have a great day.